All right, you guys, I'm dying my hair. Good morning. Look at these three babies. Oh, three little babies laying on the floor. What are you doing? Sleeping. You're sleeping? Are you a little tiny baby? Did we put a diaper on your baby? Show me. Wow. Scout brought me a diaper and wipes and wanted her baby to wear one. She's like a real baby now, huh? Not a diaper like that. Good morning, Davy Crew. Woo! It is Thursday. It's Thursday. <laughs> so, I wanted to talk to you guys about something. Something that I have definitely been struggling with for... I don't know, the past month at least. I don't know why recently, I've just noticed it, but I have noticed that I have just completely like slipped out of having a routine. And I don't, okay, first of all, Josh and I are not really routine people to begin with. So keeping a routine, maintaining a routine is really hard for us, I think, because we're both kind of like more free-spirited people. So. I uh, I kind of want to hear from other stay-at-home moms. What do you do to kind of feel like you have a schedule and a routine? Because that is something that I'm really feeling like I need. I have been feeling like we wake up in the mornings and it's just like so slow moving. And by the time we like have breakfast and I'm like semi ready for the day, it's like noon. And I just want to, I don't know, like I feel like I need to put things in place. I need to be more on a schedule. These are a couple of things that I think that I need to start doing is number one, making the bed first thing in the morning every single day because there are several days of the week where I never make the bed. Um, so I think that I need to start with that. Something else is I really, truly want to make it my goal that all of the dishes are done every night before I go to bed. That is something I have majorly been slacking on. I go to sleep with a sink full of dishes and I wake up in the morning just already feeling behind. I just feel flustered and like everything is a mess. When the kitchen is dirty, I feel like the rest of the house is just a wreck. So I think that it's important for me to have the kitchen clean at night make the bed in the morning. If you have any other tips though, I would love to hear them because I just really, really want to feel more organized. Something else that I wanna do is plan the days that I go and run errands. I really need to be more intentional about that. I need to make sure that when I'm going out, I am being efficient in everything that I need because it seems like Scout and I, now that we have my sister's car, I can depend on that. I'm kind of thinking I can limit it to one day and do Wednesday because that way, like, you know, I run errands on the weekends and then Monday, Tuesday, I'll be home. Wednesday, we can run errands. Thursday, Friday, we'll be home. So that's kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, so yeah, anyways. That's a little scoop. I just spent the entire morning doing dishes because I didn't do them last night, which again makes me feel behind for the day. So, there you go. That's my little uh, my little rant on being a stay-at-home mom. I love being a stay-at-home mom, but I just feel like I need to be more organized. I don't know. I'm also working on a meal plan. This girl's naked again. Why are you always naked? I'm poking a hole. You're poking a hole in there? Look, one is now. Wow. This has been one of the best toys. It's an old coffee can. Oh. <laughs> okay. Okay. Dishes are done. The bed is made. Scout has been laying in here watching blueberries, which is what she calls it. Well, I guess I should rephrase that. The bed was made before this girl got in it. For some reason, she has named Veggie tails, blueberries. You are funny. Guess what? Lunch is on your table. Okay. Okay? Come eat. 
Naked girl. I'm naked girl. <laughs> Does that look good? Yeah. <laughs> I love it. You love it? Okay. <laughs> if you guys are wondering, these three things are probably Scout's favorite foods. Huh? You yeah. love mac and cheese, you love beans, and you love strawberries. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What are you watching? Baby Scout. Baby Scout? Okay. You were so little. Can you get down? <laughs> careful. Very careful. There you go. Okay, let's keep shopping. Look straight ahead. One down. Switch sides. Whee! I was right. Switch sides. What's that way? You're so pretty. Yeah. I'm so pretty about that. Yes. Thank you for holding still. Thank you. It's a girl. The original fudge sickle. I have a purple one. No, they're chocolate. They're brown. A brown? Yeah, because they're chocolate. Are you excited? Oh, what? No, they're brown. I'll show you. We're outside eating fudge sickles. These were literally my favorite ice cream treat when I was a kid. I loved fudge sickles. I have always preferred chocolate over anything fruity. And so Scout has never had a fudge sickle. So cheers. Cheers. Ooh, that was a good one. Scout is being my little helper and she asked if she could get her sponge and wash the windows for me. I like it. You're the sweetest little girl. I like this window and this window. Okay. Wowee. I want to wipe the window off. You're doing a good job. I'm breathing like a doggy. You're breathing like a doggy? I'm gonna be this way, donkey. You're so cute. Did you love your fudge sickle? Yeah. Here, little fishy, fishy. Yeah. Here, little fishy. She's eating yogurt and strawberries, dancing in her high heels. I know we just ate popsicles and lunch and everything and it probably looks like all Scout does is eat. But she loves strawberries, but something that she's recently started is that she will only eat them in yogurt. So with her lunch, she wouldn't just eat the strawberries on their own. So I put them inside of yogurt and now she's loving them. So get, hey! <laughs> what do you think you're doing? <laughs> Well, Scout is taking a nap, and I just wanted to check in with you guys. I am feeling so much better today, it's not even funny. It's crazy, like the little things that, they don't even take that much time, but it's like you just have to do them, and they make you feel so much better for the rest of the day. Josh should be on his way home, and I'm going to get started on dinner, and I think, maybe tonight... We might be trying a new ice cream place. We got these cards for free ice cream. It's called, oh man, I don't even have the cards. I think it's called Creamistry or something like that. It's like chemistry with ice cream. I don't even know. So we might be going to that. I think that would be really fun and Scout would enjoy it. Big disappointment. We drove all the way to Claremont Mesa, which is far for us. 
Yeah. And the line for this ice cream was down the street. And so I think Kaylee took some video of it, but you can see how long it was. There's no way. We wouldn't even have got up to, in line by 8 because it stopped at 8. Scout still wants ice cream, so. Kaylee okay, has some vanilla ice cream here, so I think they're just gonna make their own little milkshake that they make, make milkshake? With, the, with our little blender. Ice cream, ice cream. Milkshake is ice cream. You just want ice cream, not a milkshake? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You just want ice cream, not a milkshake? Yeah. <laughs> Were you said that we couldn't get ice cream? Two dopies. What? Two soapies? Yeah. Oh, I got a new soap container and she's excited about it. You are truly my daughter. <laughs> Two soapies. My do, my do, my do, my bathroom. What? Soap in the bathroom? Do we wash our You're hands? You're getting big. Mm. I wash my hands in hot water. You wash your hands in hot water? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. I don't think so. Alright, it's shout out time. It's shout out Thursday. <laughs> I want to shout out to uh, Haha ha Drew. If you have not checked out that channel, you have to. We went to Disneyland with the Coolies and the Malpies. We went to a VidCon meetup with um, Heidi. Heidi and her family. And there was like a whole collection of people that we had met before at Vlogger Fair. And then some new people that we met. But one of uh, the people that we met that we really connected with, we thought were awesome, and we've been following ever since, is Haha ha Drew. Go check out that channel. We'll link it below. Um, but take a look at their family. Very similar to our family, and um, the ages of our kids are, like, really similar, like, really close. I think I, they're literally a few days apart. I think they're a few days apart. And so I feel like we're all kind of in that same uh, stage of life. But very funny stuff, very cool stuff. Just a really neat family. Good warm juice. What? That's, that's a good juice. That's good juice. Yucky juice. No, it's, it's not yucky. It's good. It's good. I would totally recommend going over and checking them out. Show them some love. They're new to vlogging and they're already like starting out really like good. Like they're yeah. they're in the game. So anyways, I definitely want to shout them out. Uh, they're also making some really neat jewelry that you can get. And it's going to be like super affordable, cool jewelry. Um, definitely check all of that out. So that's my show. And the whole theme with like haha -ha is I think they say like always keep laughing or something like that. So they're just like a positive family which is cool and we've definitely had moments where we just literally have to laugh or else we would cry. So anyways check them out and now we're gonna eat ice cream I guess. <laughs> now we're gonna eat some ice cream. What do you think? Thumbs up? <laughs> you got chocolate on your nose. <laughs> I do feel like a terrible parent for giving her ice cream twice in a day. She had a fudgesicle and now she's having ice cream. But as a parent, you also can't promise your kids something and then not give it to them. She was like really hyped up in the car that we were going to get ice cream and then her dreams were crushed. So, thank you. She's so nice. Are you my best friend? Huh? Are you my best friend? Yeah. Besides daddy. Daddy's my best friend too. My best friend, mommy. Yeah, but you and daddy are my best friends. You know that? Yeah. Yeah. Stop. Stop <laughs> touching my back. Stop touching my back. My back. Are you a teenager? I'm my back. Oh. My I can't, back. I can't go like this? Yeah. You don't like it? Yeah. Can I hug you? No. Oh! Can I kiss you? No. What? You don't want me to hug you or touch you? Yeah. Please, can I just have one kiss? You guys, it's beginning. I don't like it. You don't like it? Yeah. Oh my word, I'm so sad right now. What? That's in my dress. You're supposed to love mommy's hugs and kisses forever and ever. Yeah. I'm cut this. <laughs> if you want another bite of ice cream, you gotta give me a kiss. Yeah. Please. Mm -hmm. Thank you. I my nose. Oh, I kissed your nose. Yo, yo, yo. Boom. Look at that clean kitchen, guys. Look at it. This is night one. Yeah. Of the rest of my life. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but I do feel accomplished. So 
Scout said, Mommy, can you please read to me? So I'm going to read to her, and then I'm going to edit this video. So thank you guys for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Go check out Haha ha Drew. It's a really awesome channel. They're such a cute little family. They remind me so much of Josh and Scout and I. Bye. Bye.